Hi there, Right to Bite here with GrowingUpOtaku.com and I've seen a lot of questions about exactly how OnLive handles its video quality versus various internet connection speeds. What's minimum? What's best quality? Where do the controls go soggy? Um, so I did a lot of Google Foo on the internet and actually couldn't find any real good answers on this particular question. So what I'm going to be showing you today is I'm throttling my own internet connection down to various common internet speeds and I'm going to play some split second put that video on up there let you see for yourself I'll make uh, notes in the subtitles as to any kind of control issues I've had at those connection speeds um, now this isn't a perfect test you know no matter what I do my ping is going to be you know under 40 milliseconds which obviously you're not going to see on a 5 megabit DSL connection um, the latency is going to be lower on my fiber optic run than even a cable but it's the best I could come up with so go ahead sit back I'll be posting our speed test results at the top of each video just so you can have a reminder as to what we are running at and let's play some games
So, what did we learn today? Well, we learned that OnLive requires 2 megabit downstream and 384 kilobit upstream in order to function at all. Optimal image quality and playability seems to be right around 10 megabits with a 784 kilobit, or excuse me, 768 kilobit upstream. Anything after that's gravy. Um, shockingly, at the 5 megabit line, I preferred playing at a 2 megabit connection. Now, this would be because of the downgraded image quality that's fairly obvious in the videos. And unfortunately, internet being what internet is, people would scream if the 5 megabit line was actually dropped down to the 2 megabit quality. So, while I understand why they configured it the way they did, eh. Also, in a real-life test with real internet connections running at these speeds, the connection most likely is not going to be as solid as it is you see here today. Um, most likely, if you do have a 5 megabit connection, you probably are going to be averaging about 3.5 to 4.5 megabit anyway, which is why you're going to occasionally see the picture change or drop in quality settings based on what OnLive detects when you first pull it up. Also, every game on the online service, in my experience, performs a little bit differently. So your results will vary according to title. Service is free. Demos are free. Definitely a try-before-you-buy situation when you are dealing with either a inconsistent or low-speed internet connection. Hope you've enjoyed this batch of testing. Go ahead, give us a thumbs up if you like what you see. Stop on by and visit us sometimes at growingupotaku.com, and I'll see you next time.